Smells so good. Oh yeah, smells like summer. Hi friends, I'm Chef Daniela and welcome to My Choice Kitchen. This is a space for choosing joy. And today we have a very special guest in the house. Carly, what's up, girlfriend? Nothing. <laughs> It's good to see you. It's good to have you. Thanks for coming to My Choice Kitchen today to cook with us. Yeah, you're welcome. Well, today we're going to make a delicious recipe. It's right out of my cookbook. And we're going to do a grilled peaches recipe perfect for when it's hot weather with a ricotta and a little sweet almond sauce to go with it. Okay, are you ready to start cooking? Let's, Let's go! <laughs> Cut two organic ripe peaches in half vertically through the stem and remove the pits using your fingers or a spoon. Brush the peach with coconut oil, then place the peach cut side down on a hot season grill for eight to 12 minutes, stopping halfway through to flip them. Did you know that peaches get sweeter and juicier as they ripen? Here's a peach picking tip. Holding the peach in the palm of your hand, squeeze it gently. If it's soft and heavy, it's ripe and juicy. And for this recipe, use the ripest peaches you can find. Next, chop the almonds. They're a great source of protein, fiber, and good fats, the mono and saturated kind. I can do it rather quickly because I'm supported by the base of my body. This is like what they call the chef stance. And it really helps. Place them in a bowl and then drizzle them with agave nectar and almond extract. Ooh, it smells like cherries. It smells like almonds. Cherry and almond are in the same family. Very good palate, chef. Gently mix it all together and set aside until ready to plate. Now let's check on the peaches. The juicier they are, the faster they grill. So when the sides feel soft to the touch, flip them over using your tongs and grill the other side until the peaches are tender all the way through. Who's feeling peachy? We're using non-dairy almond ricotta cheese, a nut cheese that is full of healthy fats and protein. Add coconut sugar and lemon zest using a rasp grater, which makes small shavings from the outer skin of the citrus. Scoop off every last bit of the zest to not waste a thing. Add the juice of half a lemon or other citrus like orange. Then fold this together until all the ingredients are mixed evenly. Take the peaches off the grill when they are soft and ready. The flavor and fragrance comes out even more when grilled. Mm, smells so good. Oh yeah, smells like summer. <laughs> Let's make the sweet sauce. Add two tablespoons of regular or vegan butter in a pan over medium heat. Next, add one tablespoon of honey or agave nectar to cut down the sugar, along with the lemon juice. Strong, look at your muscles. Yeah. <laughs> Lastly, add the spices. Carly's using cinnamon and fresh grated nutmeg, but the choice is yours. Try ginger, coriander, or even cloves. Just a little more spicy. Okay, here she goes. It's her choice kitchen. Simmer for three to five minutes, watching carefully as the natural sugars caramelize very quickly. Take a look. Do you see the butter is starting to get actually brown? Yes. It's starting to look like, kind of like honey or maple syrup, yes? Yes. So it is done. You can tell that it's thick and ready. Go ahead and turn the heat off. That's it. Are you ready to plate this delicious dish? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna take a peach. Okay. Place it down. Take a little bit of the ricotta, just like a good spoonful. And I like to spoon it right inside, inside that like part where the pit came out, right? Yes. And then another peach and kind of like, you know, place it on and squish it. It's kind of like a sandwich. sandwich. Yeah, <laughs> grilled peach and ricotta sandwich. And then a little bit of ricotta again on top. That's a lot of ricotta. It is, but it's really good. It's kind of like the sauce for the, the whole setup. Yes. And then I like to then take, you know, some of these and I, I just take it in my, in my fingers and I kind of like let them fall where they may. And then want to finish it with just a little bit of sauce. And then it's warm still. So it's going to continue to like melt the cheese, warm up the peaches just slightly. And I also want to get some around the sides. How beautiful. Well done, lady. Thank you. That was awesome. 
Well, this is our taste opportunity, but before we taste, what we like to do at here, here at My Choice Kitchen is take a little moment of gratitude for our food. So, however you do that, I like to just take a little breath and say thanks. Thank you, food. Thank you. Okay, dig in. It's like a, a knife and fork situation. I like to go and just like get every element of the dish. Yum. I'm going for it. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. It's really good. It's like all the flavors. Sweet. Sour. Creamy. Crunchy. Crunchy. Soft. Grilled. Like, I'm getting like so many things at once. Yeah. I love your version of this. This is great. Thank you. Yeah. And the lemon's nice too, right? Um, I think that there's a little bit too much lemon. Too, le too much lemon zest or juice? Juice. If I make this again, I probably do the lemon and orange. Oh, great. Like, because mm -hmm. we use lemon for the almonds and then the, the orange for the sauce because then it also helps to tie everything together with the peach. You Cause... sound like a pro. Can I ask you some questions about your knowledge of, of cooking beyond My Choice Kitchen? Yeah. Um, I'm curious to know, can you tell me a little bit about how do you know when a choice is healthy for you? Like I can taste more flavor than if you go to like a fast food place where there's not a lot of flavor. It's just like mellow and crappy. But then if you have healthy foods, there's just a burst of flavor. Yeah, you, you're absolutely right. You can tell that when something is more nutrient dense, it has more flavor. Like this is like full of flavor, right? Yeah. It's like full of all of it. I want another bite. <laughs> I, I just really, I learn a lot from, from being with you and uh, from watching you cook. So thanks for being a part of the show. I really appreciate it. You're welcome. So until next time, subscribe to My Choice Kitchen, come back for more. We have so much in store, but we wanna rejoice in choice in the meantime. And we'll see you guys later. Bye friends. Goodbye. <laughs> All right, are you ready to start cooking? Let's go. <laughs> let's go. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> we finally did it.